Hi everybody, welcome to my channel, to Real Start. Our next project is about space. Um, areas around, between or within an artwork, okay? Um, there's also other ways of showing in the space here, okay? So space, we have vanishing point, horizontal line, you know, what makes up space? Overlapping, okay? Overlapping, the size of it, how you place certain uh, sizes of objects, um, we can tell space if it's further away or closer to us, and perspective also. Perspective is uh, deals with vanishing point, uh, it has a horizontal line, and our object, okay, and all the lines fall and um, point to that direction to the vanishing point, okay. Uh, so placement also how you uh, how you place certain things we can tell how big they are not not because they're in front of each other means that uh, they're closer to us it's just uh, maybe they're next to each other but at the same time they're the, the same size so um, On this little example here, we have a mushroom. Okay, on the that's our foreground. Okay, that's the the closest thing to us. The middle ground is this tree. That's area or object uh, right at the center of the drawing or painting. And our background, obviously, that's the background. That's obviously what's further away on that uh, painting or drawing. So we have the mountains. So this will be our, our next project. Basically, either you can do um, a one-point perspective or a two-point perspective. Okay, one-point perspective is um, let's do that together, guys. One-point perspective. First of all, we gotta do, we gotta draw our horizontal line. That'll be here, you know, kind of in the center of your paper. That's horizontal line. Then we're gonna have all our vanishing point, guys. So here, BP, vanishing. Aquí estamos poniendo la línea horizontal. Aquí pusimos nuestro punto de el punto hacia todas las líneas donde se van a dirigir de nuestro objeto, ya sea una carretera o postes de luz. A mí me gusta usar ese ejemplo de una carretera y postes de luz. Uh, what we're gonna draw here is an example of a, a light poles and a street, okay, a road. So, what we're gonna do is use a ruler. Okay, we're gonna use a ruler. Um, this is my pocket ruler that I use in class. Now, this is our road. We show how it's closer by wider, right? And it's bigger. Things that are further away or smaller tend to get smaller. So, a road tends to have right the yellow, the lines in the center. We draw some lines here to guide us. Okay, these are the edges of those uh, lines in the road. Okay.
uh, light poles, okay. So here, let's say our poles are gonna be, uh, let's start from back here. Okay, and there, the next one is gonna be, obviously, um, I'm gonna use this, let me see. They have the electrical wires that connect from here to here. Vanishing point where all the lines go to the center. The road goes from here to down to the center. All the lines. We have our light source hitting every single object, casting the shadow of every pole down here. Same here, same here. Okay. And we have our horizontal line. Okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe to Reels Art. This was the element of space and with one point perspective. Thank you.